In mathematics, an ordinary differential equation ODE is a differential equation containing one or more functions of one independent variable and the derivatives of those functions. The term ordinary is used in contrast with the term partial differential equation which may be with respect to more than one independent variable. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Differential equations. A linear differential equation is a differential equation that is defined by a linear polynomial in the unknown function and its derivatives, that is an equation of the form a 0 x y plus a 1 x y plus a 2 x y plus plus a n x y n plus b x equals 0 display style underscore 0 x y plus a underscore 1 x y plus a underscore 2 x y plus c dots plus a underscore n x y carrot n plus b x equals 0 where Zero x display style or underscore zero x a n x display style or underscore n x and b x display style b x are arbitrary differentiable functions that do not need to be linear and y y n Display style y l dots y caret n are the successive derivatives of the unknown function y of the variable x. Among ordinary differential equations, linear differential equations play a prominent role for several reasons. Most elementary and special functions that are encountered in physics and applied mathematics are solutions of linear differential equations. See holonomic function. When physical phenomena are modeled with nonlinear equations, they are generally approximated by linear differential equations for an easier solution. The few nonlinear odes that can be solved explicitly are generally solved by transforming the equation into an equivalent linear ode, see, for example, Riccati equation. Some odes can be solved explicitly in terms of known functions and integrals. When that is not possible, the equation for computing the Taylor series of the solutions may be useful. For applied problems, numerical methods for ordinary differential equations can supply an approximation of the solution. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Background. Ordinary differential equations (ODEs) arise in many contexts of mathematics and social and natural sciences. Mathematical descriptions of change use differentials and derivatives. Various differentials, derivatives, and functions become related via equations, such that a differential equation is a result that describes dynamically changing phenomena, evolution, and variation. Often, quantities are defined as the rate of change of other quantities for example, derivatives of displacement with respect to time, or gradients of quantities, which is how they enter differential equations. Specific mathematical fields include geometry and analytical mechanics. Scientific fields include much of physics and astronomy, celestial mechanics, meteorology, weather modeling, chemistry, reaction rates, biology, infectious diseases, genetic variation, ecology and population modeling, population competition, economics, stock trends, interest rates and the market equilibrium price changes. Many mathematicians have studied differential equations and contributed to the field, including Newton, Leibniz, the Bernoulli family, Riccati, Clairaut, D'Alembert, and Euler. A simple example is Newton's second law of motion the relationship between the displacement x and the time t of an object under the force f is given by the differential equation m d 2 x t d T two equals F x T 
Display style m frac mathrum d carrot two x t mathrum d t carrot two equals f x t, which constrains the motion of a particle of constant mass m. In general, f is a function of the position x t of the particle at time t. The unknown function x t appears on both sides of the differential equation and is indicated in the notation f x t. Topic definitions. In what follows, let y be a dependent variable and x an independent variable, and y equals f x is an unknown function of x. The notation for differentiation varies depending upon the author and upon which notation is most useful for the task at hand. In this context, the Leibniz's notation dy dx d2y dx2 dny, dxn is more useful for differentiation and integration, whereas Lagrange's notation y, y, y n is more useful for representing derivatives of any order compactly, and Newton's notation y, 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 display style dot y d d o t y overset y is often used in physics for representing derivatives of low order with respect to time. Topic: <laughs> General definition. Given f a function of x, y, and derivatives of y, then an equation of the form f x y y y n Minus one equals y n display style f left x y y l dots y caret n one right equals y caret n is called an explicit ordinary differential equation of order n. More generally, an implicit ordinary differential equation of order n takes the form f x y y y Y n equals zero. Display style f left x y y y l dots y caret n right equals zero. There are further classifications. Autonomous a differential equation not depending on x is called autonomous. Linear. A differential equation is said to be linear if f can be written as a linear combination of the derivatives of y. Y n equals i equals zero n minus one a i x y i plus r x Display style y caret n equals sum underscore i equals zero caret n one or underscore i x y caret i plus r x, where a i x and r x are continuous functions of x. The function r x is called the source term, leading to two further important classifications: homogeneous if r x. Topic. 0 and consequently 1 automatic solution is the trivial solution y 0 the solution of a linear homogeneous equation is a complementary function denoted here by yc non homogeneous or inhomogeneous if r x does not equal 0 the additional solution to the complementary function is the particular integral denoted here by yp the general solution to a linear equation can be written as y equals yc plus yp. Non-linear a differential equation that cannot be written in the form of a linear combination. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> System of odes. A number of coupled differential equations form a system of equations. If y is a vector whose elements are functions, y x equals y1 x, y2 x, ym x, and f is a vector-valued function of y and its derivatives, then y n equals 
f x y y y y n minus 1 Display style Math BF Y carrot N equals Math BF F left x Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N one right is an explicit system of ordinary differential equations of order N and dimension M. In column vector form Y one N Y two N Y M N equals F one X Y Y Y Y N minus one F two X Y Y Y Y N Minus one F M X Y Y Y Y N minus one Display style begin P matrix Y underscore one carrot N Y underscore two carrot N V dots Y underscore M carrot N end P matrix equals begin P matrix F underscore one left X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N one right F underscore two left X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N one right V dots F underscore M left X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N one right end P matrix. These are not necessarily linear. The implicit analog is F X Y Y Y Y N equals zero Display style Math BF left x Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N right equals bold symbol zero where zero equals zero 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 is the zero vector. In matrix form F one x y y y y N F two X Y Y Y Y N F M X Y Y Y Y N equals zero 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 Display style begin P matrix F underscore one X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N F underscore two X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N V dots F underscore M X Math BF Y Math BF Y Math BF Y L dots Math BF Y carrot N end P matrix equals begin P matrix zero zero V dots zero end P matrix for a system of the form F X Y Y equals zero Display style Math BF F left X Math BF Y Math BF Y right equals bold symbol zero Some sources also require that the Jacobian matrix F X U V V Display style frac partial Math BF F X Math BF U Math BF V partial Math BF V be non singular in order to call this an implicit ode system. An implicit ode system satisfying this Jacobian non singularity condition can be transformed into an explicit ode system. 
In the same sources, implicit ODE systems with a singular Jacobian are termed differential algebraic equations DAEs. This distinction is not merely one of terminology. DAEs have fundamentally different characteristics and are generally more involved to solve than non-singular ODE systems. Presumably for additional derivatives, the Hessian matrix and so forth are also assumed non-singular according to this scheme, although note that any ode of order greater than one can be and usually is rewritten as system of odes of first order, which makes the Jacobian singularity criterion sufficient for this taxonomy to be comprehensive at all orders. The behavior of a system of odes can be visualized through the use of a phase portrait. Solutions Given a differential equation f x y y y n equals 0 Display style f left x y y l dots y caret n right equals 0 a function u i r r is called a solution or integral curve for f if u is n times differentiable on i and f x u u u n equals zero x element of i. Display style f x u u l dots u caret n equals zero quad x in i. Given two solutions u, j r r and v, i r r, u is called an extension of v if i j and u x equals v x x element of i. Display style u x equals v x quad x in i. A solution that has no extension is called a maximal solution. A solution defined on all of R is called a global solution. A general solution of an nth order equation is a solution containing an arbitrary independent constants of integration. A particular solution is derived from the general solution by setting the constants to particular values, often chosen to fulfill set initial conditions or boundary conditions. A singular solution is a solution that cannot be obtained by assigning definite values to the arbitrary constants in the general solution. Topic: Theories. Topic: Singular solutions. The theory of singular solutions of ordinary and partial differential equations was a subject of research from the time of Leibniz, but only since the middle of the 19th century has it received special attention. A valuable but little known work on the subject is that of Houghton 1854. Darbo from 1873 was a leader in the theory, and in the geometric interpretation of these solutions he opened a field worked by various writers, notably Caserati and Cayley. To the latter is due 1872, the theory of singular solutions of differential equations of the first order as accepted circa 1900. Topic: <reduction>, Reduction to quadratures. The primitive attempt in dealing with differential equations had in view a reduction to quadratures. As it had been the hope of 18th century algebraists to find a method for solving the general equation of the nth degree, so it was the hope of analysts to find a general method for integrating any differential equation. Gauss showed, however, that complex differential equations require complex numbers. Hence, analysts began to substitute the study of functions, thus opening a new and fertile field. Cauchy was the first to appreciate the importance of this view. Thereafter, the real question was no longer whether a solution is possible by means of known functions or their integrals, but whether a given differential equation suffices for the definition of a function of the independent variable or variables, and, if so, what are the characteristic properties. <laughs> Fusion theory Two memoirs by Fuchs inspired a novel approach, subsequently elaborated by Thomae and Frobenius. 
Collett was a prominent contributor beginning in 1869. His method for integrating a nonlinear system was communicated to Bertrand in 1868. Klepsch 1873 attacked the theory along lines parallel to those in his theory of abelian integrals. As the latter can be classified according to the properties of the fundamental curve that remains unchanged under a rational transformation, Klepsch proposed to classify the transcendent functions defined by differential equations according to the invariant properties of the corresponding surfaces f equals 0 under rational one-to-one -one transformations equals topic lies theory equals from 1870 sophus lies work put the theory of differential equations on a better foundation he showed that the integration theories of the older mathematicians can, using Lie groups, be referred to a common source, and that ordinary differential equations that admit the same infinitesimal transformations present comparable integration difficulties. He also emphasized the subject of transformations of contact. Lie's group theory of differential equations has been certified, namely, 1 that it unifies the many ad hoc methods known for solving differential equations, and 2 that it provides powerful new ways to find solutions. The theory has applications to both ordinary and partial differential equations. A general solution approach uses the symmetry property of differential equations, the continuous infinitesimal transformations of solutions to solutions. Lie theory. Continuous group theory, Lie algebras, and differential geometry are used to understand the structure of linear and nonlinear partial differential equations for generating integrable equations, to find its lax pairs, recursion operators, backland transform, and finally finding exact analytic solutions to de. Symmetry methods have been applied to differential equations that arise in mathematics, physics, engineering, and other disciplines. topic sturm liouville theory sturm liouville theory is a theory of a special type of second order linear ordinary differential equation their solutions are based on eigenvalues and corresponding eigenfunctions of linear operators defined via second order homogeneous linear equations the problems are identified as sturm liouville problems slp and are named after jcf sturm and j liouville who studied them in the mid 1800s slps have an infinite number of eigenvalues and the corresponding eigenfunctions form a complete orthogonal set which makes orthogonal expansions possible this is a key idea in applied mathematics physics and engineering slps are also useful in the analysis of certain partial differential equations Topic: Existence and uniqueness of solutions. There are several theorems that establish existence and uniqueness of solutions to initial value problems involving ODEs, both locally and globally. The two main theorems are, in their basic form, both of these theorems only guarantee local results, though the latter can be extended to give a global result. For example, if the conditions of Gronwall's inequality are met. Also, uniqueness theorems like the Lipschitz one above do not apply to day systems, which may have multiple solutions stemming from their nonlinear algebraic part alone. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Local existence and uniqueness theorem simplified. The theorem can be stated simply as follows: For the equation and initial value problem, y equals f x y y 0 equals y x 0 display style y equals f x y quad y underscore 0 equals y x underscore 0 if f and f y are continuous in a closed rectangle r equals x Zero minus a x zero plus a times y zero minus b y zero plus 
B Display style R equals x underscore zero A x underscore zero plus A times Y underscore zero B Y underscore zero plus B in the xy plane, where a and b are real, symbolically a b element of and times denotes the Cartesian product. Square brackets denote closed intervals. Then there is an interval i equals x zero minus h x zero plus h x zero minus a x zero plus a display style i equals x underscore zero h x underscore zero plus h subset x underscore zero a x underscore zero plus a for some h element of where the solution to the above equation and initial value problem can be found. That is, there is a solution and it is unique. Since there is no restriction on f to be linear, this applies to nonlinear equations that take the form f x y, and it can also be applied to systems of equations. Topic: <laughs> Global uniqueness and maximum domain of solution. When the hypotheses of the Picard-Lindelof theorem are satisfied, then local existence and uniqueness can be extended to a global result. More precisely, for each initial condition x0, y0, there exists a unique maximum, possibly infinite open interval i max equals x minus x plus x plus or minus element of r plus or minus infinity x Zero element of i max display style i underscore max equals x underscore x underscore plus x underscore pm in math bbr cup pm inf t x underscore zero in i underscore max such that any solution that satisfies this initial condition is a restriction of the solution that satisfies this initial condition with domain i max display style i underscore max in the case that x plus or minus does not equal plus or minus infinity display style x underscore pm neq pm inf t there are exactly two possibilities explosion in finite time limbs up x x plus or minus y x infinity display style limbs up underscore x to x underscore pm y x to inf t leaves domain of definition lim x x plus or minus y x element of omega Display style lim underscore x to x underscore pm y x in partial bar omega, where omega is the open set in which f is defined, and omega display style partial bar omega is its boundary. Note that the maximum domain of the solution is always an interval to have uniqueness may be smaller than r. Display style math BBR may depend on the specific choice of x zero y zero example y equals y two display style y equals y caret two. This means that f x y equals y two, which is C one and therefore locally Lipschitz continuous, satisfying the Picard Lindelof theorem. Even in such a simple setting, the maximum domain of solution cannot be all r display style math bbr since the solution is y x equals y 0 x 0 minus x y 0 
plus one Display style y x equals frac y underscore zero x underscore zero x y underscore zero plus one, which has maximum domain r y zero equals zero minus infinity x zero plus one y zero y 0 greater than 0 x 0 plus 1 y 0 plus infinity y 0 display style begin cases math bbr and y underscore 0 equals 0 4 pt left inf t x underscore 0 plus frac 1 y underscore 0 right and y underscore 0 greater than 0 4 pt left x underscore 0 plus frac 1 y underscore 0 plus inf t right and y underscore 0 this shows clearly that the maximum interval may depend depend on the initial conditions. The domain of y could be taken as being r x 0 plus 1, y 0, display style, math bbr, set minus x underscore 0 plus 1, y underscore 0, but this would lead to a domain that is not an interval, so that the side opposite to the initial condition would be disconnected from the initial condition, and therefore not uniquely determined by it. The maximum domain is not r Display style math bbr because lim x x plus or minus y x infinity display style lim underscore x to x underscore pm y x to inf t, which is one of the two possible cases according to the above theorem. Topic: Reduction of order. Differential equations can usually be solved more easily if the order of the equation can be reduced. Topic: Reduction to a first-order system. Any explicit differential equation of order n, f, x. Y Y Y Y N minus one equals Y N Display style F left x Y Y Y L dots Y carrot N one right equals Y carrot N can be written as a system of N first order differential equations by defining a new family of unknown functions Y I equals Y I minus one. Display style Y underscore I equals Y carrot I one. For I equals one two N. The n-dimensional system of first-order coupled differential equations is then y1 equals y2 y2 equals y3 y n minus one equals y n y n equals f x y one y n. Display style begin array RCL Y underscore one and equals and Y underscore two Y underscore two and equals and Y underscore three and V dots and Y underscore N one and equals and Y underscore N Y underscore N and equals and F x Y underscore one L dots Y underscore N end array More compactly in vector notation Y equals F x Y display style math bf y equals math bf f x math bf y where y equals y one y n f x y one y n equals y two Y N F X Y one Y N 
Display style Math BF Y equals Y underscore one L dots Y underscore N quad Math BF F X Y underscore one L dots Y underscore N equals Y underscore two L dots Y underscore N F X Y underscore one L dots Y underscore N Topic Summary of exact solutions Some differential equations have solutions that can be written in an exact and closed form. Several important classes are given here. In the table below, p x q x p y q y and m x y n x y are any integrable functions of x y and b and c are real given constants and c1 c2 are arbitrary constants complex in general. The differential equations are in their equivalent and alternative forms that lead to the solution through integration. In the integral solutions, lambda and epsilon are dummy variables of integration, the continuum analogs of indices in summation, and the notation xf lambda d lambda just means to integrate f lambda with respect to lambda. Then after the integration, substitute lambda equals x without adding constants explicitly stated equals. Topic: Software for OD solving. Equals Maxima, an open source computer algebra system. COPASI, a free artistic license 2.0 software package for the integration and analysis of ODEs. MATLAB, a technical computing application, matrix laboratory. New Octave, a high-level language, primarily intended for numerical computations. Scilab, an open-source application for numerical computation. Maple, a proprietary application for symbolic calculations. Mathematica, a proprietary application primarily intended for symbolic calculations. Julia programming language, a high-level, multi-paradigm, open-source, dynamic programming language primarily intended for numerical computations, although it is flexible enough for general-purpose programming. SageMath, an open-source application that uses a Python-like syntax with a wide range of capabilities spanning several branches of mathematics. SciPy, a Python package that includes an ODE integration module. Chebfin, an open source package, written in MATLAB, for computing with functions to 15 digit accuracy. NUAR, an open source computational environment primarily intended for statistics, which includes package for ODE solving. EROS.NET, a free ODE solver for .NET. See also Examples of differential equations Boundary value problem Laplace transform applied to differential equations List of dynamical systems and differential equations topics Matrix differential equation Method of undetermined coefficients Numerical methods for ordinary differential equations Recurrence relation Separation of variables Notes <laughs>